If you love playing adventure and RPG games that can make you money in the process, then this video is for you. I am Mr. Diamond of the Crypto Diamond Channel, and today we're going over Nine Chronicles, a blockchain RPG with a fully decentralized fantasy world where everything you mint is an NFT. But before I get started, please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button to stay up to date with my crypto content. And I'm still doing the Shrapnel Extraction Pack Giveaway Contest. If you want details on how to get entered into that contest, you have to watch to the end of the video. Alright guys, here we are, Nine Tail or Nine Chronicles.com. For some reason I have Nine Tails stuck in my head from Pokemon. Sorry about that, guys. But it is Nine Chronicles, an RPG running on blockchain technology with a fully decentralized fantasy world, like I said in the intro. And it is actually ranked the top fifth game in blockchain space. So it is actually pretty popular and has been around since 2020. So it's been around for almost four years and backed by Ubisoft. And for those of you who don't know who Ubisoft is, they do make games like Zombies and Call of Duty. So they have been seeing a lot more of Ubisoft in a lot of the blockchain gaming world. And actually, you don't even need anything in your wallet to play this. It is free to play. You can go ahead and play this for free now. It doesn't cost you a single thing. And I'll have a referral link down there below that'll get you some extra tokens as well as me. So we'll be helping each other out. As you see, it is ranked the fifth top game in the world on blockchain with over 200,000 community members and 140 different countries on board playing this game as of right now. With a ton of partners, guys, like I said, anywhere from Ubisoft, Binance to the Sandbox, they have many more partners as well. They do have their own currency, which is Nine Chronicles Gold, and we'll go over the price of that on CoinGecko a little bit later in the video. And all the resources you see above me will be right down here below me in the description of the video as well. If you want to check that out, see more about Nine Chronicles on your own, it'll all be right down here, guys. Once again, feel free to do your own research. And they do have stake staking in this game as well. I'm going to show you when we do a little gameplay towards the end of this video, you'll be able to see how you can stake your tokens that you earned in the game and earn extra rewards in the process. It's one of the first blockchain games I've seen where you can actually stake your earnings inside the game. It is an adventure RPG game, so you do have to clear stages. There is a little bit of adventure to it. It's kind of mindless. You can play it on your PC or your cell phone. It is really addicting. I mean, even though I did play it myself last night, for some reason it just sucks you in and you keep on playing it really not a lot of different kind of it's, it's the same kind of gameplay through the entire game but for some reason it's really addicting all right and you see at the very top up here you have get started earn events community docs and bb chronicles so they do have a white paper they have been around for three years this is a trusted project so if you want to go ahead and jump in it doesn't really cost you anything to get in there anyways it's free to play you can make money just for playing it for free if you click up here on the get started tab which is the tab you see up there you can go ahead and install this to your pc if you want to install it to your phone you're going to go into the app store or the play store search nine chronicles m and go ahead and download that but i will go ahead and put the phone download links in the description below as well and once that's installed you're going to want to go ahead and create an account on the game itself not actually from here and you see up the top right corner i already have my name and profile made which will go ahead and sync to the web page once your actual game account is created and if you come over to the earned page you can see i've already earned 1.2 ncg i'm definitely going to hold on to those because it's still early on in the gaming world and i see some of the gaming tokens actually shooting up later on and you can actually claim your rewards right here from the web page as well while you're playing the game as you see right here when i reach level 50 i can go ahead and claim another token so what we're going to do here is go to install reward because i was saving this for the purpose of this video where i can go ahead and claim my rewards i've actually already installed this to my cell phone i is around 600 megabyte download so make sure your phone has enough space for the download it is like i said 600 megabytes would be the maximum needed for this download so we're gonna go ahead and claim all the rewards and it's there you see my diamond my character is level 33 already we're gonna claim those rewards and that's gonna go right 
to my gaming account and it can take up to 30 minutes just from what I can read in the notes. Doesn't mean it's gonna take 30 minutes, but it could take up to 30 minutes if the network is busy. So if it doesn't get there right away, don't fret. And let's jump on over to the white paper because I did have some things highlighted. I wanted to go over particularly with the nine Chronicles Gold, which is the in-system currency plus the cryptocurrency itself, which can be traded later on for fiat. Nine Chronicles Gold is the main currency used in the world of Nine Chronicles. Players can spend NCG to craft powerful items, trade with other users, challenge each other, and accelerate growth. And you do need it on the marketplace though. So when we go into the shops and I show you the shops in the game, you'll see how much gold you would need to buy certain kinds of weapons, anywhere from one to a couple hundred pieces of gold. The total supply as of right now is going to be 1 billion tokens, but there's only a fraction of that circulating right now. So it is a four year distribution model, but let's jump into the coin gecko. As you see, the name of the token is NCG. It is not actually ranked in CoinGecko right now, which means you still have an early entry opportunity. All right, and let's go over the prices for the year. As of right now, it is up 45% for the year, 29% in the past 30 days, 12% in the past two weeks, 7% just this week, and just 2% in just the past 24 hours. So this token has actually been doing a pretty nice increase over the year. Nothing crazy like the other coins where you see 200%, but this is pretty good. When you see small increases like this, you're gonna have a lot less pullback. Slower, steadier growth stays there a lot longer than huge rapid growth. When you see huge rapid growth, you expect the fallout to happen shortly after because that's that's market stabilization, just part of investing. And now the moment you've been waiting for, let's go ahead and jump into the gameplay. Okay, and when you launch the game on your PC, you see this box right here. It has your wallet address at the top, your gold token count right here, or your NCG coin, which is the gold token you see right there, and then start. Let's go ahead and hit start and start the game. And it's gonna load a separate box or separate window as you see over here. And here is the main menu of the game where you have different options like shop, workshop, the arena, where you, starting level is 18, I, but I highly suggest being over level 200 before you even jump in there if you don't wanna die right away because it does consume your tickets to go in there. And adventure, this is where you're gonna go ahead and actually start your game right here. But let's go ahead and jump in shop so you guys can overview of kind of what the prices of the NFTs are going for right now. And you have your nice selection over here of equipment. And here you go. You can actually click on it, see the CP value, because that's how they rank your character is based off your CP score. And this one definitely increases your health and attack, gives you your stats right there, and how much gold it costs to buy. So this is currently 3,800 gold tokens, or the NC tokens. And then you also have a difference between armor, or selection between armor, belts, necklaces, rings. Then you have the workshop where you go ahead and upgrade your NFTs or your current in-game stuff. As you see, I've already have unlocked this sword. You, you can go between basic or premium. If you go premium, it costs a bit more in supplies and diamonds, but it gives you better gear. But that's up to you if you want to spend the extra. And here, before you get to start, you have your selection of equipment. This gear is for attaching your cell phone version of the game so when you go ahead and download this portion to your cell phone you get these extra skins that are allowed in game that increase your cp value as well and boom i just jumped in another 1100 and i look like a little dog but let's go ahead and play the game now and do a test run so you guys can kind of get a basic idea of how to play and you can also do this from your cell phone looks exactly the same from the phone as it does from the pc where you're seeing it right now i've tested on my phone so it looks exactly the same you're not seeing anything different <laughs> And here we come to a boss fight, and this is where I actually gonna close out the gameplay after we kill the boss here. And if, as you've seen, for every time I completed a quest, I got some hourglasses and some of those vials. Those are the action point vials that you need to go ahead and refill your action point gauge to so keep on playing at the top. And it gives you a choice to keep on going or not. Let's go ahead for one more round before we go ahead and close this out. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and go back to the main. So when you're done playing, just let the countdown finish. It'll bring you to this stage. We're gonna go ahead and either go keep playing or hit main. I totally didn't hit main. 
or you just hit escape and it takes you back on the keyboard if you're playing PC. And as you can see up here, I did get some items that drop to this box at the very top of the screen. And they'll show right here in your inventory. And then you can equip different items depending on what you want to play, world boss or arena. Make sure you have your equipment selected for each one of these tabs. And you also get runes as well. And you go ahead and equip those. Make sure they're equipped. They help out with your score too. If we click on the tabs up here, you do see rewards. And you can go ahead and click those if you want to earn them. And it brings up the webpage where you go ahead and grab those. I can withdraw. See, there's my balance. I now have 6.2 NCG tokens. When I started this video, I had one. So I earned five tokens just in the time that I started this video to the end here where I was showing you how to play the game. So I definitely earned some income right there in a short amount of time. All right, and that's all I have for Nine Chronicles. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me on the Crypto Diamond Twitter, the Crypto Diamond Telegram, or the Crypto Diamond Discord. If you want to get entered into the giveaway contest, you don't have to like this video, share this video with a friend, and leave a comment saying Merry Christmas. Everybody have a great day trading. Goodbye.